I uh, received this today, infrared forehead um, thermometer. Um, took a few days to come in the post, but uh, quite impressed. The unboxing. Um, you have instructions, instruction leaflet. You need to scan it to enlarge it because the the the, the writing's quite small. A little certificate to say that it's been tested. Anyway. Looks like 19 uh, February 98. Not sure unless it's just a number at this moment in time. It's um, nicely packed, secure, nicely compact, very comfortable. Uh, you need to buy some batteries, but you can get them a quid from Pound Saver. There's a little plus sign just there to means that's to the top. So they turn the battery with the dimple at the top. Minus sign there, so that the dimple goes to the bottom. And good to go. Three buttons, the main switch, press it, or you press it on first, and the switch allows you to go Fahrenheit or centigrade. And then there's a pattern for surface or body. The body has the coloured um, LED so that if it goes too high as a fever it'll turn red. Um, to prove that I shall just um, scan my and it's also got memory button where it saves I don't know how many memories I haven't tried it enough yet but if I, if I point this to my to my forehead when it beeps and it tells me I'm um, 36.2 um, and that's on body. Now if I uh, if I test it on the kettle just touch it to get it working if it's on body and press the kettle it tells you straight away you've got a high temperature but if I change that to surface, it tells me 65.9 and I've just warmed the kettle up a little bit. So yeah, very impressed. And then for the memory, press it to activate. And then you've got memory one, uh, memory two that I've just done, um, too high number three and my temperature number four. So yeah, I'm, I'm quite impressed with it. Very compact. Well worth it. Very handy to keep in the uh, medicine cabinet or as it is at the moment, keep it in your pocket or bag. And then when you go into a, go into a shop or someone comes to visit, um, then especially the family or, or um, visitors you can test the temperature before they come in and record it so you're quite safe yeah 10 out of 10